Be oh, out man. here. Oh yeah. That's what you come to say in that bay for. Oh yeah. How'd it go down? So, uh, fishing these big boulders out here, you know, we're in about uh, half of the water and uh, you know, I think he was uh, ready to ready to chomp, you know? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Trying to catch small moth and they're not playing, so catch a large moth here and there. It has been a grind so far out here on the old Saginaw Bay. You made the video. Yes! It's not looking like it's going to be a very good video right at the moment. No. We're in the promised land and it sucks. Them boys. Oh, sorry. I'm not gonna catch anything on that cast, but you know, I yeah. cast it. Oh, that's pretty weak. What is that, 7.6? Yeah. We got five inches on me. What's cracking, guys? Day two update. On day two of pre-fishing, we ended up actually finding smallmouth on beds, which was a light of hope for us. We'd been searching for smallmouth for a while of pre-fishing, hadn't found any, so we finally located some, saw some decent ones, three pound class fish, but nothing that was gonna win the tournament. But it gave us that hope. We did catch some largemouth that day as well, uh, but that's the update on day two. Wind noise was bad here, so that's why I didn't have the audio. Day three practice, about to get fired off here. Just jumping on the lake, we get a half day today. The way BASS works is it's uh, two and a half days of pre-fishing and then we fish the tournament. So um, we're gonna go out there today, hopefully find some stuff. It's a little calmer day, should be fun. Looks like there's a little may mayfly hatch tonight or there was one, so we'll see what that does. But hopefully we can find some bass today. That is the goal. There's a small one. See it? Some in there? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Little guy. Yeah. Unreal. It's a massive rock. Giants out here. What the heck's that orange thing in your boat? There's Erickson and Charlie Wright. Right behind that seat there. Look at Yeah. Old Gigantor. Just got boiled on. Flip back in there. He came right back for the old Apex jig. Mmm.
not even really a little butter, it's about the same. He may tickle too if he's lucky. Fish number four has been a grind out here, guys, compared to what we expected. Pre-fishing was dumb. Pull up on some grass, catch the heck out of them, and now we're struggling with the sun. Interesting. There you go, that's a decent one. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's a decent one, Char. Two something. Two thirty. Begging. All right, we got five. L. The poor apex just got molested. Oh, well, we gotta be like a four pounder. Wasn't even recording. Yeah. All right, guys, I think we found him. You should show the camera when you're done. Or you can do it right now. Oh. oh get up here. Just do like a picture. Oh. 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 Again? Or maybe, I don't know. It's not level at all. It's. Oh god. This is special. We came through right there last time. That was a waste of time. Do not get over that. I don't know if we're going to be able to get over this again. cracking guys we're back at the hotel day one's complete we got 12 pounds eight ounces today out there and tomorrow i think we're gonna just stick to the river and see what we can make happen um didn't get it done today uh but it goes like that sometimes the waves were just too big for us to try to go for smallmouth today and uh need to protect char's boat at all costs it's gotten beat up pretty bad over the last few days of this week fishing out here on Saginaw Bay it's definitely a lake that 
it destroys equipment it's crazy it's not good so we're gonna just go out there have fun tomorrow and see how big of a bag we can put together y'all stay tuned for day two